You know that saying, everything but the kitchen sink? Well, we're just doing nothing but the kitchen sink because we are taking out the kitchen sink. That's our neighbor, Minu. She's watching. What do you think so far, Minu? So far, so good. <laughs> Lynn is doing great. <laughs> I think it's gonna do it. sink out but now we're trying to figure out how to get the whole kitchenette area out and there are just all these secret screws in here we just can't unlock the counter what are you doing i am trying to take this countertop out the last couple of screws holding it in here we go you ready oh yeah oh that feels so good That's how it was pretty much held in, is by the countertop. And now we have a pre-made chicken coop. Negative. Just put a few chickens right in those um, little holes there. Negative. So if you look over here, you had this heater, but you also have this one too. And so those are the intake vents for this one and it ran it run that all the way back to the bedroom back there. There you go. So what was it? Just get out like look at that old carpet. See, it looks like there's water damage there. You see it? Yeah. In the floor? Yeah. It looks like there's water damage to the subfloor there, or to the flooring. So it's a lot of different things that come into to play with that. I'd be willing to bet, like, this looks like a repair that somebody did on the hinge to the door. So that's probably a spot where it's letting in water. And it looks like the sheeting or the the um, seal that goes around this door. I mean, it's it's fairly intact, but at the same token, there's there are spots where it's um, where it's not totally sealing. And you have right here, like looks like somebody got smart and drilled some holes out here and there. And, you know, it, it's probably let in little bits of water over time. By smart, you mean dumb? Yeah. That's part of the reason why, the other reason I was um, interested in having an Airstream that hadn't been totally, like, disassembled yet because, you know, sometimes when people take things apart, they don't actually do the best job at it. I don't know. I don't know how else to put it, but I mean, it doesn't look too bad. It feels intact at least, but it's there's a little bit of sponginess to it there. But you can see how it's like soaked up water. So that's why I want to replace the floor with with uh, marine grade plywood. Like, look at this. <laughs> what? Oh, man. Ouch! 
Well, we bought Mickey's house! Disney World! Woo! That's a common problem that happens with RVs is you get mice, so. Hey, that's disgusting and I did not know that because I hate mice. I love all of God's creatures except mice. This was the old carpet they had. Oh yeah. When they built this, they carpeted everything and then put everything on top of that. Yeah. I think we we're gonna come up with a better way for like eating and stuff. How cool would it be if this used to be like, if this was an old like Airstream used by drug runners or something, we found like a million dollars in it. That would be kind of neat. Wait, I see a ghost! Right there! Do you see him? You're a goofball. <laughs> Who am I? Kevin from Kevin! Home Alone. Well, I think we made a lot of progress. Uh, the next steps are going to be, obviously, we have to make a dump run, get rid of some of this stuff that we don't need. We're going to be identifying the parts that we want to keep so that we can make our templates for when we build, rebuild our new cabinetry. Um, and then we get some of this stuff out of the way. I think our next big hurdle is gonna be, if you wanna come in and look. The next big hurdle is going to be the wardrobe. And the, you can't see it from here, but the drawers, um, like the dresser drawers, all that side. We'll get this whole left side done, or be the right side, the starboard side of the Airstream done, and then after that, it's gonna be refrigerator enclosure and the bathroom. Dun dun dun. Lynn's yep. favorite room, as we call it, the experience chamber. Jeez, you don't call or it. Or Lynn's <laughs> entertainment chamber is what I call it. Why do men go to the bathroom for so long? Can anyone answer this question? Oh, you, women don't even have a. Don't even. <laughs>